Hi there and welcome to Gamma. Today I'm going to show you how you can take a Google Doc. In this case, it's a WebQuest template and um, get Gamma AI to generate a website for you in just a couple of uh, seconds. Um, you can time it and see how fast it is. So let's get started with our gamma. So let's click on create your website now. So here we go. I'm in. I have an account going to create new by going into new. And then notice what my options are. I can generate from a one prompt import file or URL, which is what I'm going to do. And then notice my options here, import from Drive, and that is Google Drive. Notice uh, Google Slides, but only the text, or in my case, Google Docs. So let's connect the two by going into my drive. Okay, it's really, really simple. And I'm looking for WebQuest. WebQuest template. Okay, maybe it's enough to write WebQuest, but let's do the whole thing. And then uh, here it is. This is the one. Notice I have a few of them. So I'm going to click on this one and then select and wait. Now notice, do I want a presentation? Do I want a website? Do I want a document? I want a website for my WebQuest template. So it looks a lot more beautiful, not just a Google Doc. Click on continue. And then you can start. Well, that was fast, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, I didn't even have a chance to time it. Notice um, you can also uh, generate notice here, text, uh, and uh, fill in the outline with added details. I want that. And then amount of text per card. I want it to be detailed, uh, right for educators and instructor and tone. Okay, I think everything is fine. AI images or here. Okay, so we can AI images, uh, new. Okay, and, uh, and I think we're all set. Format of the website. Okay, we've got the format. Okay, so I think we're all ready to go. Continue. And here it comes. All right, so before we continue, we want to decide on a template. Okay, which template do we want to use? Daydream. Okay, so we've got a choice here on the left. Uh, I like a white background generally. So you've got all of these options and just think, these are all completely free. Okay, lovely. All right, so uh, we need to decide, right? So I'm going to go with let me take a, I think this one, yeah. Those are the colors. And then click on Generate. Okay, here goes. Notice here um, your accent color for the links, primary button. There we could see that. And here it comes. The perfect society. Okay, so you can see how fast, right? This is truly fast. Okay, I'm going to close the left here so that we see only the center. Okay, so it's happening and I'm not doing anything. I'm just wait and watching it as it happens. Like what you created at another page. No, I'm going to publish this one. I can change the themes, by the way, if I don't like the one that I chose. But I think I like it. Okay, I could choose black. Maybe black. If I do, um, then that's what's going to happen. It's going to be in black. I think I'll go back to this one. Okay. <laughs> All right, you can change your mind as many times as you wish. All right, so let's go into publish so I can share it with you. This is a template of a web quest called The Perfect Society. Okay, now we can visit the site. So here it comes. 
the perfect society. Notice start web quest. Okay, images, it's all ready. And start the web quest. Okay, so here it is. Okay, made with gamma will be there. Notice that I'm not sure that I like the background. Maybe. All right, so I think I'm going to go with uh, black. I'm not sure that this is what I like because I don't like the background here. I can't really see the font. Um, and it's not really orange as I thought. So maybe. Maybe I can change that. Let's go back into gamma. And instead of publish, we're going to, um, let's see. Okay, I know that. Notice here, less than a, a minute, publish this page, preview the page. All right, I think just for the sake of this video, we're going to go with this. But if you'd like to make changes, notice here on the left, you can make changes, forms and buttons. You can change the coloring. So you can actually also edit with AI. Notice, okay, I, um, I changed the colors here a little bit uh, to reflect what I want. And uh, you can rewrite this for a five-year-old. Isn't that nice? Uh, that might be a good idea. More professional, suggest a professional th theme, split into columns, turn this into a timeline, italicize. So you've got all of these. Um, I think suggest a professional theme, maybe. So here you can communicate, notice. Uh, this is the flamenco. You can open theme picker and change the colors. Maybe black would be better, or maybe the soft coal. Yeah, that looks kind of nice. Show me a quick tour. So begin tour next. Okay, we don't need the tour right now. But I think this might be better because close to, because I can see the font a lot better with the black uh, background. So I think this would work. Yeah. Okay, so this is a bit better. But as I said, you can play around with it. Okay, so there, visit the site. And here it is now. I think that's a lot better with a contrast. Okay, so here we are. WebQuest spelled correctly. Right, so that's it. Let me know if you're interested in learning how to create WebQuests. I offer a free online course every July. Today's the last day to register for if you're seeing this today. Uh, let me know and um, I'll share the link with you. So thank you for watching. Enjoy Gamma.